diary of a little kid from time to time. But to call this quote-unquote novel something worth reading, well, in my opinion, and remember this part is completely my own opinion, this novel is trash. Like so, why are you suddenly being so critical? You see, when I do these fan game reviews, I tend to look at the positives above the negatives. Yes, I'll still point out the flaws that I particularly do not like, since, like I said, it's a review based on my own personal experiences. But when I have to go read what's basically a Wattpad fanfic in order to give you all context for what's inside this book, I'll stop calling it that now. It is literally a free text file you download off of Game Jolt. What am I doing in my life now? Hello everyone, today we are reviewing the text file, The Return to Freddy's, The Dreadful Truth. At least partly, since if I review the whole thing, it will cause this video to extend a further 30 minutes. Ahem. Chapter 1. It starts off in a secret Japanese government facility called Gilbert Facility, meant to save people from super cancer. I heard about this a while back, and people were basically leaning on the creator for creating this concept of super cancer. I thought they were lying, or it was exaggerated. No. This is the second sentence in the whole book. This is apparently a super contagious cancer that has no cure. One day, they had a crazy idea of transferring a person's soul into some sort of object and calling this the Save the Kids program. I am not an author, but even I can understand the writing, pacing, and concepts thrown in just the first paragraph alone is something that is laughable. If you think that I am somehow making this part up for shock value, and just to make fun of the creator for some reason, go download this file for yourself. It is completely free on Game Jolt. In Chapter 2, it is so hard to understand who is who to be honest since it just jumbles up into incoherent sentences. But Allison finds an interesting antidote bottle that says antidote being run for tests that is supposed to cure the super contagious super cancer virus but has side effects. Wrong effects by the way. Like itchy.